Hi guys, it's Belinda again. <clears throat> it is uh, 7 9 2012. Um, this video is unlike the other one. This one is about my actual journey. And, you know, tomorrow is my first, uh, is my two week post op uh, weigh in. And you guys know some, from several videos ago, I was having issues and wondering if I was eating too much. So I called <clears throat> several people today. I called <clears throat> my doctor and spoke to the um, one of the. Um, nurses that took care of me and takes care of me every time I go. Excuse me, guys. And, um, I told her my concerns and I asked her what, um, size, uh, French that they use on me and they said a 32, which is a two ounce, um, pouch. And I told her what I was doing. She said that it sounded like I was probably eating a little bit too much and what she said she did when she had her surgery was she weighed out two ounce or two ounces of everything for quite a while she said so I did that today and it seemed to do a lot better for me so I'm going to continue to do that um, and she told me to you know make sure I look back in my binder and go through that and, which I'm doing that now too which I wasn't do I was doing a little bit before not, not, not as much and um as usual, they're always sweet. I love my staff up there, and they're just absolutely wonderful. You can't get any better than them. They're fabulous. Love you guys if you're watching. Um, then I called my nutritionist at Blunt Memorial Hospital, which is the same place I called um, to my doctor. They're all in the same building. Um, Heather, Miss Heather Pierce, and she's my nutritionist. And I asked her about how many fats, carbs, uh, sugars, calories. Um, saw all that I should have her serving, and she told me that none of that really matters right now except for how much uh, uh, um, water and protein are the key things for now and will be for a while. She told me not to worry about other things, but just to keep an eye on them and do them as low as I can, but there's no set number right now. And I also asked her and my nurse if uh, if I can get my protein in. Um, without having to take the shakes this early in the game, can I? And they said, absolutely. And I'm able to get the protein in without the shakes, so I may stop doing the shakes or just drink them occasionally because they are nasty, y'all. They're getting to, I mean, at first they weren't that bad, but now it's just they're, they're just nasty. I don't want to drink them anymore, um, which means I have to find a new way to um, put my take my vitamins because I crunch my vitamins up and put them in the shake. I'll probably just have to crunch my vitamins up real good and put them in my yogurt or something else. Um, so I can do that and that works. Um, I'm super excited and super nervous and worried about tomorrow with it being my first uh, weigh-in since, uh, you know, my first official weigh-in. You know, two weeks per stop. So it's kind of nerve-wracking, but I guess I'll make it through it like everybody does. You too. Well, but after you know, don't take me in that, fellas. After I edit all these videos and post them and watch, I got, uh, I'm gonna go take a nap. <laughs> anyway, because I gotta eat a couple more times so I can uh, get some more protein in. And I got and this is only my, uh, believe it or not, this is only my first bottle of water. And I'm usually down two bottles by now. It's almost six or six. So I've got to get on it. Um. So far today, with it being only six o'clock, I have had, um, let's see, I've already had 60 grams of uh, protein already, but you know, some of that was, the, half of that was the shake, the other half was the uh, tuna and the cheese sticks, string cheese I ate. But you know, if I, if I get up tomorrow morning, I can have, you know, I can do it. I'm sure I can do it. Um. The calories I've had 370, so I don't think that's too bad. But anyway, um, those are my concerns. That's what I want to make the video about. So hopefully things will work out tomorrow, and we'll see. So cross your fingers. And I'm not going to be too upset if I don't lose but a pound or two because I know it's still a process, and I'm learning how to do everything. And I may have done something wrong, you know. But the point is, is I'm losing weight and I'm feeling better, and I can do more things. So. And I also want to thank everyone for their support, the love, the prayers, the kindness, their beautiful words, their beautiful sentiments. Everything that you guys have done to support me over the last seven months has been amazing. And I also want to thank my new subscribers and the old subscribers as well. 
Um, I want to also thank my family because they've been very, very important and integral part of, of me being able to stay on this journey. And I also had some good news to report that uh, my fiance, Charles, which we call him Chuckles, um, he is losing weight. He lost, I think, 12 pounds last week and a half. He um, decided to get on the Fentramine main pill to help curb his appetite so he could lose some weight. And he wants to get down to about 330s. He's about, he started out last year at 451, now he's down to 422, so it's it's doable. And if you would, just pray for him too. I appreciate it, guys. I love you all. God bless. Smooches.